Hoy ya en YouTube ven con vos 6 en Town OG Estoy aquí, no me ha tu nada Shamado Mambai in Gawais. Now, when I say it's in the middle of nowhere, it's just somewhere that I've never heard of before. Not many people's mentioned before. I don't mean to offend anyone. If you live around here, then I'm sure, you know, it's not considered the middle of nowhere. But it is a beautiful place. It's very beautiful scenery and there's many cachoeiras around here. So what am I doing here? I'm staying here with the family of Tamis. So I'm staying with Omai Della, Opai Della, Ochio Della, Achia Della, y Yuvovo Della, Avovo Della. <laughs> grandmother, grandfather, I never know how to pronounce that properly in Portuguese. Anyway, we are here, staying here for a few days as a little vacation, a little holiday, and not really doing much, just kind of taking it easy. We have a nice big house with many rooms, um, has a swimming pool, a nice big outdoor area, a lot of things just to chill, you know? The facilities just to chill. Um, so I want to show you guys around a little bit. I'm going to show you this, this house we have here. This is the inside, obviously we've got a little kitchen area here. A little lounge area here. And this house is a, it's quite old. It's very basic. It's just got the basics. Nothing fancy. As you can see, the TV is, is, is quite old. But it doesn't matter because it's not about that. It's about spending time with family. It's about being outdoors, enjoying the good weather and just kind of playing board games, getting in the pool and having fun with each other. That's what it's about. It's not about the facilities of the house. So to show you a little bit more. A few bedrooms here. All the bedrooms have multiple beds in. It could probably sleep about 12 different people in here. It's a very big house. You can see it's different types of bedrooms. And I think this is our bedroom. <laughs> our bedroom. Yes, this is our bedroom. So I'll take you outside. Here's the area outside. As you can see, it's a very beautiful pool here. A table there. Just beautiful scenery in general. You see a lovely sunset over there in the evening. You can hear how peaceful, how quiet it is. Oh, it's Tommy's grandfather, grandmother, Tommy's, Tommy's sister. You can see the front of the house. It is a long drive. So to get here, you have to drive along this track here, which is about a 20 minute long track. And it's very, very bumpy. There's a lot of holes. It's quite difficult to drive along, quite uncomfortable <laughs> to be sat in the car. Um, but it is, yeah, like I said, it's kind of in the middle of nowhere. It's a farmhouse in the middle of nowhere. The nearest town is Mambai, which is about a 30 minute drive away. It's a beautiful house though. And a beautiful area. So one of the things about this house, it also has a cachoeira just five minutes away. So we're gonna take a little walk down there. I'm gonna show you this little cachoeira. It's a bit, it's a little trial just outside the house. So the house is just here, look. And so we're gonna walk down there now. Tommy and Thais. Her family's already down there, so. We went down there earlier, but it was raining, so we came back and her family took the wrong way, actually, because <laughs> they didn't believe us. We went the right way, they went the wrong way. We told them that it was this way, but they didn't believe us. And then obviously we went, we arrived there before them and then they arrived as we were coming back because when we arrived, it started raining. Anyway, the sun's back out now. For the most part, it has been sunny in the past two days. We spent a lot of time in the swimming pool playing with the, uh, the volleyball 
playing some ball games with the family. It's been nice to get away. It's something that I traditionally do with my family as we go on family holidays to like a big house. I go with my brothers and their, their partners and their kids and I go with my parents. So this, this kind of um, holiday is, is quite familiar for me. It's something that I'm used to, it's something that I really enjoy is to go away to a house and just spend time with family. No distractions, not near any big cities or anything. Um, and just kind of cook, eat, drink a little bit and chill. So yeah, that's what, uh, that's what it's been like here. And it's been nice to do that because a lot of my time exploring in Brazil has been kind of, you know, as much as I love going out in Brazil and exploring new places, it can be quite tiring sometimes because you're constantly trying to look for things to do. And when you arrive in new cities, you're trying to figure out where to go, what to do. I mean, I love it. I'm not complaining by any means, but it's also nice to have like a place organized where you just arrive here and do nothing. Usually when we arrive in a new place, we, we go there and we're trying to figure out what we're doing next. We spend the day out, come home and figure out what we're doing the next day. Here, we just do nothing, which is super chilled. So the path is a little bit rocky, right? Just step down, Tommy. You can already hear the waterfall. It's a big one, it's a very big one. Quite aggressive. <laughs> Oh, so the pool as well in the house is a natural pool. The water comes from the waterfall. Um, so it's very nice, clean, and actually feels quite warm as well. You see the river over there that leads down to the waterfall. So this is where the route gets a little bit tricky because it's quite steep downhill and there's a lot of rocks. You can see this bit here, especially when you're using avianas, it's not easy, but it's the Brazilian way. Just gets a little bit rocky down here. <laughs> oh, and my aviana, aviana keeps breaking like this. That's super annoying. Anyway, I think I'm gonna have to put my phone in my pocket in order to get down this little bit here. I'll show you guys the waterfall when we arrive. Here you go, guys. This is the waterfall. I can already hear Tavi's family there. <laughs> Swimming. Thankfully it stopped raining. When we came here like earlier, it was raining, so it wasn't very nice. Olha aqui. Olha aqui. Tommy and Thais, they're gonna make it down as well. It's beautiful.
Now this was the best investment of the day, of the whole holiday. <laughs> Shoot that! <laughs> so yeah this is the normal routine for the day get in the pool play with the pool for the whole afternoon and then after that we just eat <laughs> so that's all you need so guys as i was talking about before we arrived at the cachoeira i've now been here for three almost three months in brazil it's january now just the beginning of january christmas has just gone and at the end of this month, sadly, I will be going back to England because I need to find some work. I need to get back to some, do some work again. I was working a little bit remotely, doing some editing. Tammy works full time um, through her laptop. So she's been working most of the time here in Brazil, apart from when we travel, she's taking holiday. And yeah, it's been, it's been an amazing few months here in Brazil. We've done quite a lot. Obviously there's a lot more that I want to do, but there's many reasons why I can't stay here in Brazil. There's visa reasons and there's also work reasons. Um, so yeah, we need to go back to the UK before we come back to Brazil, but we will be back soon. Not leaving any time, but I'm not leaving yet guys. I'm not leaving yet. I still have a lot more videos to make while I'm here. Um, but about the travel in Brazil, yeah, it's been, so we obviously, if you don't know, we've been based in Brasilia, we're staying with Tammy's family most of the time. And if we, then we go out and travel and then come back to Brasilia. Um, so it hasn't been, you know, consistent three months of complete travel in Brazil. I mean, it kind of has because I'm not at home, but, <laughs> but there's been many, many days I've been sat in, indoors, just editing, just editing all the time, editing videos, editing for work as well. Um, so yeah, it's not all, it's not all been holidays here, but the time that I have been here, we've seen some amazing things and learned some new things, learned a lot of things about Brazil, a lot more things about Brazil, which has been something that I really wanted to do before I arrived here. And of course, one thing that I've enjoyed a lot is making these videos and sharing it with you guys. I love reading the comments and seeing your reactions to, to some of my experiences in Brazil, some of my naiveties in Brazil, um, but also like, you know, just about learning, learning things in Brazil with you guys and, and the feedback I get from in the comments. Um, I have a lot of questions about things, especially food, because I love to know about food. So it's always good that when I find a new food, I just film myself trying it and then post it onto YouTube and get, get a reaction and see the comments from you guys. Um, so yeah, I've really enjoyed that part. It's something that when I go back to England, um, I'm gonna miss a lot, but I'm gonna make some different types of videos when we return to England. Of course, Alfie is back in England and we are already planning to, to film some content together. Um, there's a lot of stuff, Brazilian related stuff in, in England because there's a big Brazilian community in in England. Um, so we'd quite like to get them involved in our videos as well. Um, and obviously some other people as well, we want to introduce some Brazilian foods to some people as well in England. So we'll try and film some of that content. But yeah, for the moment guys, um, I just want to say, take this opportunity while it's the beginning of the new year, please ano novo and obrigado para vocês, for everyone that's subscribed and you know, this. just taking the time out of the day to watch my videos and give me feedback and just comment on my videos whether it's good or bad comments I don't really mind <laughs> it's all good um, yeah I just want to say thank you guys for watching the videos all the videos so far um, I've really enjoyed being here and sharing my experience with you and we will not stop I'm gonna keep making these videos I've got more videos to make while I'm here in Brazil in these next few weeks. Um, I'll be coming to Sao Paulo very soon, so there will be videos of Sao Paulo. I know a lot of you guys have been asking when I'm coming to Sao Paulo. I will be coming very soon. Um, so yeah, I'll be filming some content there. And I'm also thinking about doing a meetup with some of you guys as well. Um, I think that'd be very cool to meet some of my subscribers, some of my followers. Hopefully we can do that. Um, but until then guys, please and Novo Bravo says, um, obviously I'm gonna, now jump in the pool, get the volleyball, start playing some games, and probably have some lunch soon as well. Ati mais, gente. Ati logo. Ciao.